Fabregas was making history as Arsenal's youngest ever player, aged just 16 years, 177 days. Cannon. Flag has stayed down. Silva walks all with so much to aim at. A moment to remember for Fabrice Fabregas, the youngest scorer in the famous history of Arsenal Football Club. The Premiership campaign began at Everton and Arsene Wenger made an early surprise selection by calling up Cesc Fabregas, who at just 17 years and 103 days old became Arsenal's youngest ever player in the Premiership. Burkham. He's found a way through to Pires and now Fabregas very coolly down. in that millisecond shows what a marvellous prospect he is. So, it's reunion night at Highbury. Patrick Vieira is back to say bonjour to some old friends and adieu to the old stadium. It's a good tackle by Pires on Vieira. Picked his pocket. by the injury blow to Cesc Fabregas, who suffered knee ligament damage after this challenge. It would cost Arsenal the services of yet another of their most influential players for three months. A lovely flick from Fabregas. Walcott is in. And Walcott has scored. Ten minutes gone. Advantage Arsenal. Well, that is quite an exquisite finish. Yes, Fabregas. 
Fabregas, he's deserved a goal, but he's been really selfless, always looking to set up others. Might have a go here, does! And that's exactly what Cesc Fabregas deserved. A really wholehearted performance in which he's created for others, and now has won for himself. Shows his devotion to the cause. For the goalkeeper, and this time the supporters have got behind the goal to stay up. And they're through again, it's Fabregas! What an end to the half for Arsenal! Frustrated for so long, two strikes as quick as lightning! Well, who said this one wouldn't be as exciting as last year's? What an air for Tottenham thinking about. Okay, they'll be disappointed. Fabregas, can he keep his nerve? He's done it! It's a remarkable turnaround in the space of 14 minutes. Cesc Fabregas, the Arsenal captain, has drawn them level on the night. He may well have hurt himself in taking the penalty, but he knows he'll miss the second leg anyway. However, he has given them genuine hope now.